The era of solar energy began in 1950 when Bell Labs focused on the development of photovoltaic cells PV, and created the first solar panels. The breakthrough was made by Daryl Chapin, Calvin Fuller, and Gerald Pearson. The efficiency of their creation was 4%. Since then, solar energy has made a leap in development and the efficiency of today's solar panels reaches more than 23%. As a result of this, countries with a lot of sunny days can generate clean electricity by making full use of the power from the sun. For example, in the UAE, the world's largest power plant was built for this purpose. But what about countries where it is cold and there is a lot of snow? Not everyone is as lucky as Iceland, which literally is located on hot water. It seems that Japan has found a way out for cold regions. They have decided that it is possible to generate electricity from the snow. How? We will talk about that in this video. What records do you associate with Japan? The oldest person in the world the fastest trains, the highest life expectancy. All this is true. But Japan also has the snowiest city in the world. It is neither located in Canada nor in Norway. In Aomori, up to 8 meters of snow falls during the winter, and the daily record is 2 meters of snow. Why is this happening? After all, this is not even the northernmost city in the country. The answer is, is that Aomori is located on the coast in a bay surrounded by mountains. Several strong winds blow around the city. They collide, rise, and fall as precipitation. Due to heavy cloud cover and low temperatures, precipitation instead of rain immediately turns to snow. How does the city cope with so much snow? In general, they traditionally welcome more tourists. But there are issues with transport. For instance, the National Highway is closed for the winter after which it usually takes a snowplow team about a month to clear it in March. When so much snow lies uselessly for months, would you have the desire to do something extraordinary with it? Well, the Japanese would not be the Japanese if they had not come up with some absolutely innovative and necessarily high-tech solution that would improve the lives of everyone around. This time, they decided to build a so-called snow power plant. That is, they plan to produce electricity with snow. The system was invented by Koji Anoki, an associate professor at the Graduate School of Computer Science and Engineering. Now in Aomori, instead of dumping snow into the sea as usual, it will be taken to an unused pool at a former school. There, it will fill special pipes that contain a heat-conducting fluid. Under a layer of snow, the above-mentioned pipes will be cold and on the surface of the pool they will remain open and can be heated by the energy of the sun. Due to the temperature difference, fluid movement will constantly be created in the pipes. This is not magic as it's not a perpetual motion machine. This is thermodynamics, specifically the effect of a thermosiphon. Because the cold liquid is denser than the hot one, it sinks down faster and pushes the hot liquid to the surface. Thanks to this movement, it will rotate the turbine of an electric generator, which in turn generates electricity. Now, Almori is starting to test the technology and such experiments will last until spring. If the project is successful, then Almori has other additional advantages for its development. There are many hot springs in and around the city. With their help, it is possible to heat pipes with fluid even more efficiently. And the higher the temperature difference, the more efficient the fluid flow and the more electricity is generated. Additionally, the creators are confident that their installation is easily scalable in both directions. It can be either increased to an industrial scale or reduced to a size suitable for a private home. Every year, Almori spends millions on snow removal. And this is an additional plus for the profitability of this project because the cost of delivering fuel to the power plant can be neglected. According to forecasts, on an industrial scale, such electricity should be cheaper than solar and wind ones. But these are not all its advantages. Meanwhile, unlike wind generators, the snow power plant does not ruin the landscape and does not cause soil vibration. For it, they can use already built unused objects with tanks. And unlike solar energy, the snow plant does not take up much space and does not require complex as well as expensive disposal of components. 
El Mori has long learned to cope with the peculiarities of its climate. In winter, many lovers of skiing and snowboarding come here. Tourists walk through snow labyrinths higher than a man, and all visitors take part in the snowman festival and other activities. If the snow also provides free electricity to every household in the region, then we will see a new clean energy industry in action, which can become a benchmark for other cold regions.